Hey guys, welcome back to another edition of What's On Your To-Do List. I'm Egypt Strickland. And I'm Andres Escalar. Oh, you see? You see? Hola. Hola. <laughs> this week at Armstrong Atlantic State University, they're kicking off the Hispanic Heritage Week with Grammy-nominated troupe Sonas de Mexico Ensemble Chicago. Yep, it's a good group from what I hear. Apparently they take American folk music, like say this land is your land and they play it in Spanish you know the lyrics but with Mexican beats pretty cool group you can check them out at Trustees Theater Thursday night at 8 p.m. the free. event is free. free yes because the city of Savannah is also sponsoring the event with Armstrong's Ola group um, they're gonna have Latin dance lessons uh, an Argentinian film Bombon el Perro Dog. Um, I got dog out of that. Yeah, wow. yep. She knows some Spanish. <laughs> um, some alumni panels, just lots of stuff going on. Make sure to pick up an issue of Do and find out what's going on at Armstrong for Hispanic Heritage Week. Now, Check it if out. you go, make sure you take photos. Upload them at spotted.savannahnow.com. And over at Savannah State, the theater troupe over there, the Players by the Sea, is going to be performing Juice. They have, I believe, uh, some kind of sponsorship from Get in the Know. What are they? Get in the Know is an HIV, AIDS, substance abuse, and hepatitis prevention project oh. at Savannah State University. Juice is a dramatic musical mm -hmm. that uh, addresses the transmission of HIV, the devastating effects of AIDS and the disease, and the relationship between this virus to substance use, risky behavior, and abuse, as well as hepatitis. A mouthful, basically just say no. Yeah, <laughs> but just be careful. But you can go and see the play Friday night. This performance on Friday is going to benefit the West Broad Street YMCA. They're accepting donations. For information, you can just email MyersJ at savstate.edu. 7 p.m. the 25th to the 27th. Oh, and I heard the music for it was really good. And it was produced by Dad's Production out of Savannah. Pops. Check it out. <laughs> If you guys don't have anything to do this weekend, let me tell you, the Jazz Festival at Forsyth Park, it's where it's at. It's perfect to take out a date, awesome evening, great music. Wait, wait, what's that? You recognize that tune? Yeah, um, what? What's TV. It? TV. It's from yeah. uh, Taxi. Yep, what's the name of the guy? The James Cotton. Yep. James Cotton will be in town this week for the Jazz Festival. He's actually playing Thursday night at Forsyth Park. Yep, I 9 think it's at 9.30, yeah, that's right. A lot of people are going to be playing Pick Up, an issue of Do, find out everything you need to know, the schedule, there's you know a lot of info on James Cotton, his blues band. Guy actually has a Grammy, he, in 96 he won a Grammy for the best blues album. Um, what else do we know about him? I don't know. Pick it up. Pick it up But if you do go, out. take pictures, upload them at spotted.savannahnow.com. And one more thing, you know Nina Simone? I do. She's a great icon, music. Her daughter is going to be performing with the Savannah Jazz Orchestra. And I think she's playing Saturday night, so make sure to check her out as well. Seems like it's going to be a great jazz weekend. All right, Egypt. What do we have this weekend? We have Mexican music with Sones de Mexico. We have a musical juice over at Savannah State. All kinds of jazz at Forsyth Park, but there's also West African Rhythms at Lucas Theater. At Lucas Theater. It's actually this Saturday, 8 p.m. If you want to go, you can get information online at lucastheater.com. Ticket prices? 20 to 30 bucks. Or anywhere in between. Yep. It's <laughs> called the West African, the Song and Dance Ensemble of, of West, West Africa. Africa. Make sure to check her out. Apparently they dance tremendously well. Lots of good moves. Oh, you know, I have something, and this is out of character. Let me drop this. Notice? <laughs> Ooh. If you hadn't, I'm expecting. And I'm actually giving away a trip for two to Atlanta. It's the LL Cool J. Do you mind if I announce this? No, please go ahead. Okay. Guess if it's a boy or a girl, log on to the website at 941thebeat.com. You'll be automatically entered to win this trip. Airfare, hotel, LL Cool J, and Janet Jackson. So what is oh, okay. little Egypt baby boy, baby girl, what's it going to be? Find out. <laughs> All, All right. right. Till next week, I'm Andres Escalar. And I'm Egypt Strickland. Bye, guys. Have a good weekend. <laughs>